Welcome to all the aspirants. Today we are going to discuss about 4th December current affairs. First of all, let me start with the last day GK question. The states and this Kaiwa and Akoki Naga land. The states and this Dalkai and Gotipuwa Odisha. The states and this Daman and Dandas Punjab. The states and this Panigari and Gapal Rajasthan. The tribes in Jharkhand are Burgors, Bumsh, Savar, Ho, Karwar, Logra, Magli and Kol. M. Subbalakshmi, Chidambaram Subramaniam, received Bharat Ratana in 1998. Ramanuja Charya introduced the philosophy titled Visistha Advaita and he wrote the book titled Sri Basya. He was also known as Elaya Parmal. The method of rule of law, office of CAG and parliamentary privileges were taken from Britain. The fifth fire plan was launched between 1974 to 1978. So, the fifth, during the fifth fire plan, we launched the Garibi Hato slogan and 20 point program and minimum needs program and Indian National Highway System. Article 275 explained about grants from the Union to certain states. The first Indian Women Speaker of his State Assembly, Shano Devi, Tama Revolt held between 1789 to 1832 and by Aran tribes under the leadership of Bola Nasage in Chota Nagpur area. The famous festival in Maharashtra Kalidas Chikku Utsav. Ramesh Chandra wrote the book titled The Civilization of India, Peasantry of Bengal. And today's scheme, India Semiconductor Mission launched on 2022. Digital Agriculture Mission launched on 2021. Pradhan Mandri, Vanbandhu Kalyan Yojana 2014. Kaya Cut Scheme was launched in 2015 under the Ministry of Health, which organization honored with 2024 OPCW The Hague Award, Indian Chemical Council, who launched Global Hunger and Poverty Alliance Initiative during the G20 Summit 2024, Lula da Silva, which city is the host of Army Day Parade 2025, Pune, which mobile application has launched by Indian Railways, Sandraksha, for Safe Passenger Safety, who launched Bal Viva Mukt Bharat campaign in New Delhi, Annapurna Devi. Which airport were awarded the best airport of the year at Wings India Awards 2024? Kempi Gowda International Airport and Indira Gandhi International Airport in Delhi. Rajiv Gandhi International Airport won the best airport award at India Travel Awards 2024. GMR Hyderabad International Airport 1, Best Airport Staff in India and South Asia 2024 by Skytrax. Who became the youngest cricketer to be signed at an IPL auction? Vaibhav Surya Vamshi. Vaibhav Surya Vamshi. And the rate of the auction for Vaibhav Surya Vamshi is 1.10 crore. 1.10 crore. And the Vaibhav Surya Vamshi was acquired by Rajasthan Royals. <coughs> the fastest batsman to score 4000 runs in IPL, KL Rahul. The fastest batter to score 2000 runs in one-day international cricket, Shubman Gill. Rohit Sharma became the first batsman to hit 50 sixes in World Cup and the first Indian to hit 500 sixes in, sixes in T20 format and the first batsman to hit 200 sixes in T20. Virat Kohli became the first batter in the world to score 50 centuries in one international and the first Indian to score 12,000 runs in T20 format. Baba Razam became the quickest batter to score 10,000 runs in T20 cricket. The first Indian bowler to take 350 wickets in T20 cricket is Vendra Chagar. India to host Men's Cricket Asia Cup 2025 by means next year. UA hosted Women's T20 World Cup 2024. Where was the second edition of India CARICOM Summit 2024 held? Guyana. And the first summit held in 2019. And the first summit held in 2019. The CARICOM was established on 1973. So the CARICOM totally have 21 countries. <coughs> United Arab Emirates hosted 13th WTO Ministerial Meeting in 2024. And to host World Conservation Congress 2025. Indonesia hosted 43rd ASEAN Summit 2023. Dubai hosted World Government Summit 2024. Italy hosted 50th G7 Summit 2024. 
So G7 was established on 1997, and Russia becomes Russia becomes the part of G7 uh, summit uh, called G8, but the membership was cancelled in 2014, and now that's G7. Laos hosted 57th ASEAN Foreign Ministers Meeting 2024. Russia hosted BRICS Summit 2024. Laos hosted 19th East Asia Summit 2024 and 44th and 45th ASEAN Summit 2024. COP 29 hosted by Baku and Azerbaijan. Brazil hosted G20 Summit 2024. Who launched Bhima Saki Yojana in Haryana? Narendra Modi. And about this Bhima Saki Yojana, this scheme empowering women by creating job opportunities in the insurance sector. So under this scheme, the women will become agents of LAC and by becoming the agents of LAC, the women can sell insurance to a particular person and earn the money. Narendra Modi introduced Jyoti Sar Anubhu Kendra Museum in Haryana and he introduced Banjara Virasat Museum in Maharashtra and Tata Aircraft Complex in Vadodara and launched first Borderland Magadsav in New Delhi. Sarbananda Sonova laid foundation stone for Ayas Diksha Center in Odisha. Kishan Reddy inaugurates Kumaravali Railway Station in Siddhipet in Telangana. S. Deshankar unveiled a bust of Magatma Gandhi in Tokyo's Edogawa Ward. <coughs> Mansuk Mandiwe launched Reset Program that means Retired Sports Person Empowerment Training Program. Emma Mikion announced her retirement in which field she belongs to, a famous swimmer from Australia. And also a famous cricketer Gurukri Singhman, Shane Dowrich, Dean Elgar, Neil Wagner, Colin Munro, Kedar Jado, David Warner, Shikhar Dhawan, David Malan, Moin Ali, Matthew Wade, Tim Southey and Vridhaman Saga announced her retirement. And Indian hockey player Birendra Lakra S.V. Sunil, Deep Grey Seka and Rani Rampal. Tennis player Serena Williams, Roger Federer, Rafael Nadal, Prajnesh Gneshwar. And the football players Slatan Ibrahimovic, Diego Godin, Thomas Muller, Ilke Gundagun, Andres Nistia. And the famous badminton player Ashwini Ponnappa. Which of the following compounds is called as Norwegian saltpeter? Calcium nitrate. So calcium nitrate was, also, was known as Norwegian saltpeter. And potassium nitrate was known as Bengal saltpeter. And sodium nitrate was also known as chili saltpeter. Thank <laughs> you.